Hello everyone, thank you so much for joining me today for this dance inspired HIIT workout. If you want to stay up to date with my workouts and get fit with me, don't forget to hit subscribe and click that little bell notification to let you know when I post a new video. Let's get started with a banger for 30 seconds cross body jump kicks, just jumping in and out, crossing your knee towards our elbow for 30 seconds. Kind of like you're skipping rope, kind of like you're dancing, let's have fun today. Let's start off the next one with some lunge kicks. We're gonna lunge back 90 degrees bend with the knee, keeping our front knee over top of our front heel and kick forward for 30 seconds on one leg. We'll switch for 15 seconds on the second leg in five, four, three, two, one. Switch those legs, stepping back and kicking forward. Let's get ready for some double bounce curtsy lunges. Stepping back, double bounce, bounce and up. Switch sides, double bounce, bounce and up. Repeating for 24 more seconds. This next one's my personal favorite, some squat jumps. So every time you jump in, bring your feet together and jump back out to a squat, sit your hips low. If you cannot jump them, just opt for regular squats with your feet hip width apart. Take a step to the back. If you're mat, place your hands down. We're going to be doing some walkouts with some crossbody mountain climbers. One, two, walking back and walking back out for two crossbody mountain climbers. Rolling up nice and slow, let's get ready for some double bounce squats at the top of our mat, setting our hips low, double bounce at the base of your squat and sit back up. Let's repeat for 25 more seconds. Make sure you have lots of space beside you because we're going to be doing some lateral lunges to one side, coming back in, sitting back with your hips, keeping your knee over your toes. Take a quick breather after this for 10 seconds. We're going to be repeating the lateral lunges to the second side, so make sure you have lots of space beside you, and let's get started. Two, one, let's go.
Great job. Take a minute to breathe here. Grab some water, do a quick stretch, do what you need to do because we're going to be starting set one of this HIIT workout today. We've got six more exercises, most of which will be laying on the floor. So get yourself a seat. Let's meet on the floor for the next exercise, which is going to be alternating crab toe touches. So place your hands behind you, sit your hips up on your feet, and you're going to touch your opposite foot with your opposite hand in three, two, one. Let's get started. Alternating sides. So right hand to left foot, left hand to right foot. Let's meet in a tabletop position for our bear hold kickbacks. Make sure that your spine is flat here and try to kick back parallel to the floor. No higher, no less for 30 seconds. All right, this next one's definitely the most difficult, so get ready. We're going to be doing two plank jacks with one push-up. You can definitely alt for or knee push-up here, or you can do a full push-up. For the next one, find a pike pose or dolphin position on your elbows with your feet dug into the ground. We're going to drive our knee towards our chest, keeping our abs engaged. Bring it back and switch feet, knee towards our chest and back. Let's high knee jog it out for 30 seconds. Very last one, we're going to meet on our back, on our mat for some reverse crunches. So cross your feet if that helps you and let's reverse crunch until the end of the workout today. Awesome work today, finishing the last exercise. Thank you so much for joining me today. I enjoyed this workout so much. I felt super good after. I felt like I was ready to take on the day, kick it in the bum. Thanks again for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Stay safe and bye now.